In this video, we will show you the new version of Sawloft DIY mode. Many users' devices have upgraded the firmware to 3.5.0 and curious about what is the new of the firmware for basic R3 or FR3 and Mini. Yes, it optimized setup procedure of DIY mode and some of the API protocol. We launched the new page on Songoff website called Developer Page which shows the new DIY mode API protocol. In the section of EWI Link Mode and DIY Mode, you will see what is the difference from the old one. The optimization is the setup procedure of the device at the start. In this new version, the device can be switched into compatible pairing mode and configured with your existing Wi-Fi network directly. With such, it makes the procedure of the setup easier and faster. When the device is in compatible pairing mode, you will find the access point named as IT. Use a browser to access this URL. You can configure the device to connect to your existing Wi-Fi network. This documentation includes MDNA's discovery process and mechanism, the APIs like on and off, power on state, inching function, get the device info and so on. In the API of get device info, we have more info in this API response, the firmware version. Device ID BSS ID In the next, I will show you the setup of DIY mode device in real and perform the API request via postman. First power on the device, long press the button for 5 seconds. And the device will enter the compatible pairing mode with fast LED blinking. We can discover an access point named as IT in mobile phone Wi-Fi setting. Connect it with a default password. Access the specific link via the browser. We will see a song off DIY mode configuration page which allowed users to fill in the SSID and password of the Wi-Fi network that the device will connect with. Once these steps completed and the device connect to the existing Wi-Fi network successfully, the LED will act in fast double blinking. Like this way. Now we use a postman application to send the API request to the device. First we try the on and off request. Here I have already known the IP address of the device from my network management. Send the info request to the device, we will see the key items. Switch status is on or off. Inching function is activated or not. Which we find network that the device connect with. Firmware version. Device ID and signal strength. Now we activate the inching function, turn on the pulse, set the interval width with 500 milliseconds. So when turn the device on, it will automatically turn off after 500 milliseconds. and the signal strength request. I did not input all of the API requests here as the others just operate in a similar way. Thank you for your watching. If you would like to know more about the DIY Mode API protocol, please visit the developer link.